Hi there, it's Dave Hepworth from Computer World and I'm carrying on our videos for Ruckus Wireless Unleashed and how to configure the Ruckus Unleashed controller. So we went through previously on how easy it was to set up the master AP and now we're going to look at the actual controller built into the access point and show you what production services are available and what features are available. So we'll log in with the admin credentials that we set up earlier. And then you're instantly redirected to the Ruckus dashboard. So this is the Ruckus controller sitting on the Unleashed platform. A nice, simple, easy to use dashboard for a non-IT department or a small ID department that will be using the Ruckus Unleashed products. So from the top to the bottom, straight away on the dashboard, we can see internet, we can see if we're connected, we can see the uptime, we can see that we're logged in as admin. And then on the Wi-Fi networks, we can expand on the Wi-Fi networks and see what Wi-Fi networks are currently live with green uh, and what Wi-Fi networks is actually being or could be created. And then we can also look at client info of who's connected to what Wi-Fi network. So if we minimize that again, we can then look at clients, we can expand on clients, and we can see what clients are connected, and then we can select if we want to block or unblock or delete those users. So it's an, again a nice central point if you want to manage clients on a small wireless network. And on access points, we can then look at monitoring access points and see what access points we have live, which one's the master, and what devices are connected to those access points. And again, you can expand on client info, and redundancy info. Now we know smart redundancy is disabled but we can also look at client info so we can minimize that. And then we can also look at admin and services. So on here this is when we can look at this, the system, we can look at the device IP settings, system time, country code, roles, users and mesh. And then we can also look at services. What AAA servers we have, what access control we have in place, application recognition control, bonjour gateway, uh, DHCP server, and the standard kind of features that Ruckus are renowned for with their dynamic pre-share key. So th this is a good sign for anyone that's impressed by Ruckus services but can't actually afford a Ruckus controller. You get a lot of the features with the Unleashed platform. So we are able to offer DHCP. We do have bonjour gateway, application recognition and control. We can support AAA servers and access control. We have the the trademark dynamic pre-shared key and zero IT activation from Ruckus Wireless. And we also have the guest access service. So we can create a guest access portal or have members of staff create guest passes. We can also do that via someone sitting at reception maybe or a tip member of staff that's in charge of giving guest access. Or we can create uh, email or SMS services for guest access. It also supports hotspot services if we want to do some sort of third party hotspot with an internal system. And we can also look at radio control. So we can see, we can do some of the radio control that we expect from the, the ruckus wireless systems of a controller or a virtual controller. And we also have wireless intrusion prevention. So there's a number of basic systems that we have with a ruckus unleashed controller, which shows you how advanced the unleashed platform is for a controllerless solution and how it will fit for any enterprise that has a small number of wireless client devices that they need to connect. And then on the administer, we've got anything from preferences. We can back up and we can restore the, the APs. We can restart, we can upgrade. We can look at registration, which we need to register the product. We've got diagnostics, if we ever need to do that. And we've got how we can install certificates. Uh, check network connectivity by troubleshooting using ping or trace route. And we've also got network management with SNMP. So we've got all the kind of options you'd expect from a physical or virtual controller at an enterprise level. But what the nice about this is we actually got this built into the access point. And this doesn't affect any of the performance from any of the access points, be them the master, secondary, or any of the access points connecting up to the master. No performance is affected from the access point who is running as the master AP. So there you go, it's a really simple dashboard. And at that point, you've got an overall view of the Ruckus Unleashed dashboard and the features that you have available with the Ruckus Unleashed platform.